in Cody, Wyoming, there is a lot of things to do in Cody. They are right by the mountains, and you have a mountain, and you can go up the South Fork or the North Fork. The North Fork is the gateway into Yellowstone, and you can go all the way up and go into Yellowstone. Um, and the South Fork kind of goes up towards the mountains in a different way, and you can go and see a lot of different farming community and um, people's ranches and just a lot of beautiful sights from the top if you look down. Um, in Cody there was also the Buffalo Bill Museum that had a lot of history of the area. Um, it was a museum that had five museums in one and so it was I think the world's second largest museum or the United States I don't know but it was a huge museum and it took a lot of time to go through it but it had an art museum in there, and it had a wildlife museum, and it had a Buffalo Bill Museum, all about Buffalo Bill and his history. Um, and it had an Indian, the Wild West Museum. Um, can't remember the other ones, it had a couple more, and it was, it was beautiful, it was breathtaking. Uh, and then it had the Mural Museum in Cody as well. Um, that was uh, the Church's Museum. It's kind of uh, one of the church's hidden treasures is what many people around there would call it because so many people didn't know about it. But it was beautiful and amazing and it had a little room that was tucked off to the side um, from the museum that was all about family history. And you could go in there and you could do your family history and there's people that would help you. So you got to see this museum of pioneers and, and you got to see the murals above and um, just the beautiful paintings. So there's so much to do in Cody because there was a bunch of shops down Main Street. It was another tourist trap. Uh, and I was in there in the cold December, so there was really nobody. But uh, that was the best time because all the stores on Preparation Day were on sale because they were recycling everything through for the next summer. So you got to get a lot of souvenirs for your family to send home. Cody was also known for their rodeos. As a missionary, you really don't get to go do uh, many of those things. Um, but there was a lot of different things to do in that area if you ever wanted to. I guess for me, my favorite thing to do there was just to to walk around the streets and see the really pretty sights and meet the people. Um, talking to the people of Cody, talking to the people as they came from different places was really awesome because you got to meet them and you got to kind of touch their hearts in a different way before they'd go. Sometimes you'd only meet people for two minutes, and you only had two minutes to, to make an impact. And that was something that I always strived for, was if they walked away, and if they went back home to their hometown or wherever they were from, that I would leave an impression enough that they would wonder who the Savior truly was and, and want to look more into him and to read the Book of Mormon and to feel the Spirit 